time, not this time. Time to talk. guys it is tuesday it's our first full day here in new york last night as you would have seen we went out to explore times square a little bit we went into macy's and yeah it was really cool to like see everything in person but it was quite late for us because obviously we're coming from london and we were super jet lagged right now it's like six in the morning we woke up at like five because we're so so jet lagged yeah we're ready to get out and see where the day takes us just because i don't think i've mentioned it as well i am here with my family because we're actually celebrating my mom's birthday she's always wanted to come and to be honest I've always wanted to come it's my first time here in New York and I feel like I've grown up watching it on like TV and in films and I was obsessed with Gossip Girl I still am to be fair so it feels a bit surreal to be here but yeah we're really looking forward to getting out and just exploring and obviously I will bring you guys with me yeah. where are we? genius for breakfast <laughs> Wait, is this definitely zero? Yeah? The fun out soon enough. Yeah, that is definitely zero. Oh, this pan goes so good. Take him off? Yeah! Hi! Confetti are nice. Oh my god, I'm This is ridiculous. Why do they have pants on the As you can probably tell, I'm on the Brooklyn Bridge. We're crossing over from New York to Brooklyn, and I'm hoping to film a dance video for you guys. So, fingers crossed, I managed to get that done. But the bridge is incredible. Like, the architecture of the bridge is so, so nice. And also, we got stopped on the bridge by this photographer who was taking really good pictures. So, I will into that picture right now because he kind of killed it, and I had to like pay him $10 because he killed it. Museum, like the 9 11 museum, and honestly, it was crazy to kind of just be there and see where it happened. And like the museum, if you've ever been, you would know it goes like underground, so you're kind of like exactly where the building stood, and you can see like the original like pillars and the stuff that kind of stayed put. Um, but yeah, really, really sad, really heartbreaking what happened, and just crazy to kind of be here and see it. But yeah, we just come out and oh my god, I'm so tired, it is unreal. It's only like 6pm but my feet are killing me because we've just been walking around like the whole day. I think we're going to get some food and then head back to the hotel and then like refresh and get ready for a new day tomorrow. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Oh, look at the inside. Yeah. 
I made it to the top of the rock. I'm literally on the very top of the rock. Fire center and the views are incredible. Just look at that. Wow. Guys, I'm being the ultimate gossip girl fan girl. This is the Palace Hotel where Serena lived. Oh, I'm in Grand Central Station, and oh my gosh, this is such a cool station. It is massive. It does not look like Charing Cross back home, that is for sure. It is such an amazing and like grand station i guess that's why it's called grand central but i literally remember this so badly from the first scene of gossip girl where you see serena like in the opening scene so i know what i'm gonna be watching when i get back i'm gonna re-watch gossip girl and see all of the sights that i've seen so far but yeah it's really surreal to kind of be here for, like in person Did you not know? Your Instagram has to eat first. This is literally an apple store that is open 24 hours. It is a glass box, as you can see. And you can see into the apple store from these little like floors on the top. How crazy is that? So futuristic. I love it. Also, I may have made a cheeky little purchase today, which I'm very happy about. Guys, that is the Jonas Brothers filming some kind of yeah, back, back. I don't know if you would have been able to hear me, but literally right behind me, over there where the crowd is, the Jonas Brothers are filming some kind of music video or something. I'm not really too sure, but pretty cool. We just stumbled across the Jonas Brothers, and now we're going to go up the vessel, I think it's called, and then go and look at the High Line. So that is the plan of action today. <laughs> I made it to the top of the vessel. Down there is where the Jonas Brothers are. And I'm really out of breath because that was hard. Oh my god. What's up guys? So we have made it to just outside of Central Park and we're about to rent the city bikes which is very similar to like the Boris bikes back home in London. We're gonna like cycle around Central Park and hopefully make it to the Met, the Metropolitan Museum of Art which is really famous for the Met, the steps of the Met that are in Gossip Girl and also obviously like the Met Ball that happens every year so I really want to see it and hopefully we also get to see a bit of the Upper East Side because I really want to see the Upper East Side too but we just stopped off in Serendipity and yeah, we're gonna have a little cycle through the park, which I'm really excited about. Also, you guys, this is the Home Alone Hotel, the famous Park Plaza Hotel. So, guys, this is the Upper East Side of New York, and just down now, which you can kind of see, is the Met Museum, the Metropolitan Museum of Art, and I'm gonna get a picture on the steps because. That is what I know it for. Also, cycling through Central Park was so much fun, but my fingers are absolutely frozen. You can see how red they are. It is so cold here, but I want to get bikes back through because we cycled past quite a lot of things that I still want to see. So hopefully we get the bikes back through and we can stop off and see some of the landmarks in Central Park. This is a, what is it, the world's best cookie? From Levain Bakery, which you can't see, it's covering up. So grab, so grab, so grab, so grab, so grab, so grab, so grab. Please welcome to 
So it is my last day here in New York. I fly home this afternoon. So I think I literally only have about two hours before I need to leave for the airport. But I just popped out back to Times Square to pick up a few last minute gifts and a few last minute bits. Um, but as you can see, the weather is absolutely disgusting. It's pouring down with rain and it's so windy. So my umbrella keeps going everywhere. It's just so annoying. But I'm gonna head back to the hotel, get some lunch and then head off to the airport. But I've had the most incredible time here in New York. I'm so sad. I never wanted this trip to end. It's literally been incredible. I feel like I've grown up watching New York on like television, especially in Gossip Girl. And it was like surreal to see all of like the Gossip Girl sites in person. And just to kind of be here in New York in person has been really, really surreal. And I'm really lucky that I got to come and that we got to celebrate my mom's birthday. I know she had a really amazing time. I really hope that you did enjoy this video. I I'm gonna end this vlog here because I feel like I've shown you all of New York while I've been here. I don't know how this vlog will have turned out because I didn't have a ton of time to like talk to camera. I literally was walking 20,000 steps every single day trying to cram everything in. But I really hope you did enjoy seeing New York from kind of my angle and through this video. And yeah, I hope to do some more travel vlogs in the future. So let me know if you do like watching them. If you did enjoy this video, please don't forget to smash a big thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new around here. That would make my day. And apart from that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!